Good morning, it is 6.20. Um, my husband woke me, woke me up at 5.50. He leaves the house at 6 a.m. because Olin got out of bed. He isn't supposed to get out of bed till 6.30, but <laughs> he did. And then Norman woke up at uh, 6.10. So yeah, I'm just feeding him. Owen's watching Netflix. Good morning, Norman. Good morning. Good morning, Norman. Good Norman, Norman. Good Norman, Norman. I decided to vlog this morning because I actually tried to um, film two videos this week. Correction, I did film two videos this week. And they both didn't work out. I was super annoyed and bummed. So this morning, I just was like, you know what? I'm going to film a get, a get ready with me. I'm going to film just like a morning routine with the boys. And um, yeah, that's what I decided. Does that sound good? Okay. I came to the bathroom. Um, I had my hair in a bun, but I took it out to try to look a little more presentable. <laughs> I have been taking my makeup off at night, and of course, last night I didn't take my makeup off before bed. I literally do it all the time. I used to never take my makeup off, but then I started like never wearing makeup at home, just with Norman and newborn life. Like I just was rarely wearing makeup, and I'm trying with this quarantine to like get ready a bit more, I think because life is just like, otherwise I would never get ready and it's nice to sometimes just get ready. So in the morning when Normie, Normie's right here. Um, yes, he's on the counter in his bath seat and I stand right here. So don't worry, he's not going anywhere. I don't leave him up here. Like if I leave the room, I take him because I don't I don't trust him in here. <laughs> but when I stand here, it's fine. Oh, anyways, what am I even talking about? <laughs> so anyways, I have been wearing, I've been trying to do my makeup a bit more because you know, it's nice to still do that once in a while, even though I'm not going anywhere. But I didn't take my makeup off last night and I have been trying to like wash my face every morning and stuff. And I just like put Norm in this little seat and I wash my face. I use The Ordinary. I've only recently started using this for like two months. Never really done much, but that's, you know, getting older, <laughs> 28. And I've been noticing like my skin is not as good as it once was. So anyways, I used this little thing that actually is a baby thing. It's like a baby brush, but I was looking for face like scrubbies and I realized a bunch of them look just like this. So I figured instead of spending money, <laughs> just use this because we don't use it for Norman. So yeah, babe. So anyways, I'm gonna wash my face. Okay, so that didn't fully take off my makeup, so I'm gonna also use a just like makeup wipe. And yes, I have extremely dark under eye bags. I think it's part of just like, uh, me, and, me and my sister talk about this, like we both just have like very deep <laughs> eye pockets. I don't know <laughs> how to like what those are called, but you just have like deep under eye pockets. So I feel like that's like genetic, but then with my sleep deprivation with my child, um, obviously I have like very dark under eyes right now, but I kind of always have dark under eyes. It's just worse. Anyways, so I can link this ordinary stuff. I actually really like it and it's pretty affordable, but the bummer thing is that they only make like smaller sizes, like this is gone. So then I use, I wash my face, and then I use um, this hydrochloric yeah. acid. You guys probably don't even care. Does anybody care? Oh look, it's gone. Okay, no hydrochloric acid today. Anyways, I guess I'll skip that. And I also use 
rose hip oil because I have rosacea. Rose hip oil is supposed to help with that, but you're supposed to use it at night, but it was making my pillow all yellowy. So I stopped using it at night and I just use it <laughs> in the morning. But it does make me look like super, I guess oily for a while, but my skin's super dry. So honestly, I feel like my skin can handle it because I'm so like dry. Normie is teasing so bad. So feel free to comment below with your favorite teething suggestions, tips. I feel like I know I do things, but it's nice to hear what other people do if there really is anything to help. And then I use a, just moisturizer from them. This isn't sponsored or anything, but you know, maybe somebody cares. Wow, I used a lot. <laughs> oh no, I got some in my eyeball. It's because I'm distracted. Okay. Your brother wants a smoothie. Well, see, I have like minimal time, so I wasn't able to get ready. Sometimes if Lee's really content, I can even get ready with Norm is, but it's not one of those days right now. You got a shirt? Uh -huh. Oh good. I am gonna make Olin a smoothie. I'm just doing it in this big cup and then I can drink half of it. Um, sometimes lately I've been making us two, but I don't feel like doing that. So big cup and then we'll split it. Olin can legitimately, he'll drink the entire thing. So that's why I don't like to split them because this kid loves smoothies. Also, Norman is like totally, <laughs> Totally the type of baby that like fusses when I put him down. I should just go get my ergo, but truthfully, I usually <laughs> just like have him in my arms <laughs> and then like struggle through. Actually, you can go in your bouncer. Sometimes he's happy when he hasn't been in his little bouncer. Oli, your smoothie's ready. Um, but what happened to my tummy? <laughs> I don't know. Hey, <laughs> Cutie boy. Uh, Hi! <laughs> the flash is on accidentally. Hi, cutie! Okay, I'm back in the bathroom. I wouldn't usually try and uh, get some makeup on like in such a hurry, but God, I'm filming this. It'd be really nice to feel a little bit better. I can hear Normie. Before he starts to really fuss, I'm gonna try and get some makeup on. Norm was fussing, so that's about all I got done. It took me like four minutes, I don't know. It's only 6.50 by the way. I thought I would show you guys my kind of failed DIYs. They weren't like total fails. I feel like they weren't good enough to uh, like post a video. Cause I feel like, what was that? A month and a half ago I posted a video and like my DIYs didn't turn out as good. Like that light thing. And I feel like I got, <laughs> don't you dare eat that. I kind of got some, I don't know, not hate, but kind of hate for it. And so I sort of just felt like, you know what, instead of posting this DIY that didn't turn out that good, maybe I'll go show you guys then, but that maybe you guys would just kind of like want me to put them. Like I can show you some clips in this video. This is the one DIY I did. This was glass and it's supposed to be like a textured, you know, vase sort of thing, giving it like this old look. And it did do that. This one turned out better, but truthfully, I just don't like it. <laughs> like, I don't like it. So I can show you like little clip of how I made this thing, but yeah.
And then my next <laughs> DIY was made this little clay wall hanging, but I was making it with the boys and I just like didn't have time to do it like so perfectly. I think cause I'm always rushing, honestly. It's like I have to film and DIY. And so I just like rush because I have children. <laughs> it turned out like super crooked and just like not perfect. I feel like the idea of it is still super fun and you could do it and you could like do it better, but it seems silly to like present a DIY video, even though mine turned out kind of crappy. For this next project, we are going to be using some air dry clay and I'm going to make a circle. I was painting them and I decided to go back and paint a few of them different colors. So I painted that circle like this terracotta Then I painted the like strips, this like creamy white. And then let me show you what happened. Taking a piece of really skinny wire from my wire bundle and I am simply attaching them together. How much of that smoothie have you drank already? Look at that guys, he's drank half of it. Are you done with it for now? Okay. Usually we just sort of like hang out and make it through the morning. Um, Normie for his first awake time is usually awake like an hour and a half-ish, so. You have a green tongue for your smoothie? Yeah. <laughs> Guys, I'm shook. I just killed massive spider I didn't want to film it because you can't can't take time to set up a shot when you're trying to kill a spider <laughs> sorry I had to let Normie fuss let me show you it was in my carpet I got spider vision guys That's how I feel, Norman. If somebody gives me any sort of comment about how I shouldn't kill spiders, you better just unsubscribe right now. We let Oli bike in the house. Hi. Hi. Love you. Love you. I think today is gonna be a cleaning day. Literally. How do I feel motivated? Killing a spider. We always have a lot of spiders in our basement and they're those scary brown ones and they freak me out. And yes, I'm a bit like, I'm still talking about this because I just, they're like my biggest thing guys. I just can't. I can't with the spiders. So that makes me want to clean the house. Do we have muffins? Mm -hmm. We don't have muffin eggs. Do you want to go down for a nap? Normie just went down for a nap. I, just, I think I only want the treehouse. And Olin wants me to build him a fort. We usually build a fort like in this little nook by our like chair and our couch and the shelf. Just kind of works out. Guys, I'm still upset about the spider. <laughs> um. I don't see upset about spiders. Why am I so upset about it? Mm -hmm. I just get really upset when I find such big spiders being stuck inside my house. And I find those all the time once spring and summer come, which is like the absolute death of me. Sorry. It's like one of the first ones that I found so far. So I knew it was coming because it's finally warm. 
Oh, I should stand this way. Sun, it's so much nicer. Anyways, I'm gonna make a fort for Olin. Usually right now, sometimes I haven't had the TV on so much for Oli, so then when Normie naps, then I like to put a show on, and then I finally kind of go on my phone, answer emails, Instagram, all that stuff. Like during Norman's first nap, I try not to be on my phone for like the first little bit of awake time. And then I'll go on and do everything when Normie naps for his first nap, which they're only like 40 minutes. So I'm like, just chill for like a little bit of time. But because Oli was watching stuff already, now he wants to play, obviously. There's his fort. Do you have your shirt in your fort? Uh -huh. Okay, well go put it on. Okay. Most likely gonna be in my PJs for quite a while. I don't get dressed until I have to. We're watching Pokemon. <laughs> when Norm wakes up, I'm gonna get my clean on. I'm serious, you guys. I feel like this quarantine, it's actually hard to find motivation every day. I don't know if anybody else is feeling that. Doing little things for me, like getting ready has been helping. So I think I'm gonna like, when he wakes up, pop him in the ergo carrier. That's what I love using. Which is like, he can face forward and he likes that. I'm gonna clean. Like, just like mostly try to get everything off the ground and then vacuum because spiders like to burrow. I don't mean this be turning into like a spider chat but I don't know I feel like if you don't like spiders as much as me then you understand so I know there's gonna be people who understand and I know there's gonna be some people who don't and that's okay we're different people it's still really early it is still morning but I just wanted to show you guys like my earliest morning when is morning even end 10 o'clock is the end of morning that's like that's like three more hours people I just thought I would show you guys a little bit of my morning, my morning routine, and just hang out with you guys for a little bit. So I hope you enjoyed seeing my failed DIYs. It's kind of nice that I was able to put them in this video because I like made them and did work and then it's like really kind of sad when it doesn't work out, but that's okay. Thank you so much for watching today's little morning routine vlog i hope you enjoyed it if you did feel free to give this video a thumbs up as always you guys can subscribe for more of my everyday life follow me on instagram at emilyfay22 i hope you guys have a great day and i will see you next time